Hello you PogChamp gamers of the highest riz, it's another binge compilation for that sweet brain rot. Oh 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 Reblog this if you are LGBT plus support LGBT plus or want to violently fling yourself into the sun. Is all of the above an option? Writing prompt. An alien and a sentient robot being roommates, trying to convince the other that they are human, while simultaneously believing that the other is the peak of humanity. Leading to hilarity. Mm hmm. Call that show Beep Boop and Gleep Glop. Behold, the Game of Thrones series with a sticky tag for every time someone utters the word cowabunga. Now, wait, hold on. See that blue one right there? Uh, that's, uh, that, that's, not, that's not a cowabunga. That's a cowabummer. Everyone shut up! I'm busy having a fake relationship with a fictional character right now. Don't! Don't stop me! How's the job search going? Well. Do you have experience in cucumber? Yes, no skip. What is it? Uh, I think I experience in carrot. Get out. Heart. How many catamoticons did you kill to make that heart? <laughs> what, what? What? Less than three. Probably bad RPG ideas. Circle of protection against capitalism. This is called forming a union. 10 out of 10 edition. A good Sumerian inexplicably donated five packs of 500 temporary tattoos to the classroom, each pack featuring identical pictures of a different invasive species of bug. I met Samaritan, you jackasses. I was typing with one hand because I was putting on one of the temporary tattoos and it got autocorrected. <coughs> oh wait, the video's not done. Shoot, that's usually, that, that's usually something I say for the end. Oops. If we were to actually name Earth's moon, what would it be? Go on, chat. Give me your answer. Do you like boys? Things my homophobic pet boa constrictor whispers to me in my sleep. Three plus four being bigger than one plus you combined is wild. First graders be like, Name something that fell off harder than Subway. You literally can't. The parts on Boeing Air and spacecrafts? How dare you leave these in the tags? I don't know, man. Subway tomorrow could tell me that their Subway sandwiches cure clinical depression, and I still wouldn't go. In World War I, around 8 million horses died, but in World War II, it was only under a million. Which can only mean horses started to evolve bullet resistance. I could convince Joe Rogan that this is real. Personality. I don't give a fuck! Anxiety. I do. No post has ever described my life accurately as this one. You know, the you can be whatever you want when you grow up crowd is uh vanishing when the boy wants to grow up to be a girl. Funny how that works. If a person from Wisconsin is a Wisconsinite, then is a person from Paris a parasite? Well, that's not very <laughs> of you. Do you want to know why my brother is crying? Because my mom told him he can't have sugar. Not sugary foods, mind you. But pure, full-on sugar. In a bowl. Now he is screaming his little lungs out. Save me, Tumblr. Reblog this post only if you're older than it. People born after July 27th, 2024, do not interact. Fuck off, dude. You can't be saying that, white baby. <laughs> Fucking handles called freshly baked baby. <laughs> Don't be bullied into thinking. Really is just Twitter's mantra, isn't it? Nothing can ever stop this man from fighting for our country. Phone spares. Health insurance is cool, cause you get to pay a bunch of money each month for nothing, and then if something happens to you, you have to pay a bunch more. It's great. You should try it. Hey, why is the winner of Miss Universe always from Earth? No, 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 hold on. You got a point. I won't get vaccinated. I won't wear a mask. I oppose universal health care. I ignore infant mortality rates in the poorest states. Migrants are illegal. We need more guns on the streets. I'm fine with cutting WIC and SNAP. And I think the death penalty is just swell. I'm pro-life. I read this and I thought, oh, someone who has all my same positions. Then I realized you're mocking us. 
Oh my god, you get it! Good job! In hot days like this are perfect for refreshing Italian bubble tea. No, 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 this actually hurts the leg out. Why? No. <laughs> Eh, little treat culture's gonna get a hand. You don't need an $8 coffee because you did laundry. Sounds like someone who could use a little treat. Hey, do you think if the mask was more mainstream, he'd have been a Tumblr sexy man? Hold on. We're on to something. Behold, great value DiCaprio and generic Cruz. Delete this. Right fucking now. You know, the worst part of being a good listener is that people get creeped out by the information I've retained about them just from listening. <laughs> Oops. When I get married, my wife will be in the kitchen where she stays, and I will also be there because it's also our bedroom. We live in a very small studio apartment because we are poor. Had me in the first half there, not gonna lie. Hey, why is it spelled camouflage and not... Not what? Bro, it's not loading. Just some chill folks talking about music in my office earlier this year. Andrew, how come you didn't show off your legs like the rest of the guys? It would have blinded the entire room and sent Mark to the hospital. <laughs> oh, Mark. Oh, Mark, you precious little bee. You know, if cis people don't want us using the Latin prefix cis, meaning same side of, we could always use the Greek synonym homo instead. Trans people would be heterogender, and cis people would be homogender. Problem solved. Ah, a delicious beverage. Splendid. I shall partake right away. Do Americans actually get an ego for their 18th, or was everyone fucking with me? No, no, it was true, but unfortunately, the ego to child ratio has become very askew. I truly hate disloyal people. Eric, bro, homie, your father has cheated on every one of his wives, including your mother. Ah, uh, my ability to dissociate has become too powerful. Now I'm just watching the fall of America be like, hmm, yeah, that happens to empires. Well, I look for dog hats on Amazon. After three BAFTAs and one Emmy, finally we have won an Oscar. Please welcome Oscar James Ramsey, who touched down 1258 today for some lunch. Well, 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 well. Raw isn't so bad now, is it, Mr. Ramsey? He sits in his little cocoon and holds my hand while I work. <laughs> I don't deserve him. Having another gawk? We gotta get out of bed faster than this morning. <laughs> I mean, girl, girl, but gork works better. I didn't even question it. I was nodding along like, I'm literally right there with you, gork. Help. The cheese is haunted! Contrary to popular belief, mimics aren't wild animals, but a domesticated shapeshifter with the purpose of protecting items. This not only means that they can be tamed, but they make very good pets that are loyal and protective. They also enjoy protecting magic items, so maybe give them that holy avenger you've been keeping in a death grip for the past week. Steven? I am going to sit you down and request that you watch a 15 minute video while I gauge your reaction to see if you're laughing at the right parts. I cast two 45 second unskippable ads. I cast sponsorship by Ray Shadow Legends. I cast ad blockers that are against YouTube's terms of service. I cast don't care 10,000 beam attack. <laughs> what is even the difference between an elf and a high elf? Stop talking about Ray! When people give me compliments, I feel like a vending machine trying to accept a wrinkly dollar and it's really just frustrating for everyone involved. I've never related to anything more in my life. I even make the same noise a vending machine would make when getting complimented. It's like, you look good today. Oh, I love books. I love them so much. I'm such a bookworm. Cool, how many did you read this year? Okay, so here's the thing. I did not come here to be attacked in this manner. Get out of my house. You're so considerate. Thanks, I was raised in constant fear of upsetting people, so, you know. Today someone told me I'm nice, and I literally said, Thanks, it's the emotional trauma. Does anyone else with intrusive thoughts do that, like, weird dismissive head shake when they get them to kind of, like, reverse slash reject the thought, or is that just me? Yeah, you gotta shake your brain like an Etch-a-Sketch and start over. I feel sad because nobody knows me as the guy who loves crocodiles anymore. I used to be so vocal about it. I still love them with all my hearts, those big boys. 
Crocodiles are filled with hate. You're gonna be filled with bullets if you keep running your mouth! Presidential alert! A red panda was just born at the Chattanooga Zoo! <gasps> Look at him! Because drawing a background killed my grandma, okay? At the moment, how I feel. Yeah, my uncle broke his neck shading once. Not good. I don't identify as a boy or a girl. I identify as your fucking problem. Hey, are you ugly on purpose, Pickles? Uh, how could you say that to him? He's just a little guy. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna totally bosh this impression, but I would've gotten complaints if I didn't include the bottom part to this, so I gotta do it. I'm sorry. It's just out of my wheelhouse! I need to research why Pokemon cards are so expensive. Computer! Show me Pokemon inflation! Dexter, no! 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 You will not use AI to get ideas for your story. You will lie on the floor and have wretched visions like God intended. New evidence suggests that people's rear ends are getting heavier. But wait. There's more. <clears throat> Going about my day-to-day -day life as though I am an ancient automaton. Long since overgrown by nature. Still shambling about in a mockery of my long, forgotten former purpose. Wally, that the that the that the plot on the movie. Well, at least the the lore. Seriously though, rats are like the greatest. They've got tiny little grabby hands, sniffy little noses with whiskers. I mean, is anything better than a rat? Yeah, two rats. Why did you learn Finnish? To communicate with my parents and extended family. You see, at age one, I started to feel a bit hungry and decided I should start speaking so my parents would feed me. Hope this helps. To the one YouTube comment that's likely going to ask that they don't get this joke, they are actually Finnish. They were born Finnish. They learned Finnish. Willoughby is very gentle and kind. She never uses violence. But violence is so awesome. Okay, d don't lie to me. Willoughby may not use violence, but that is the look of a cat that definitely has mastered psychological warfare. On God, we're gonna get you some will to live, bro. You know, people accusing the MCU of queerbaiting has always seemed off-base to me because queerbaiting implies a level of emotional character interaction that the MCU has overall staunchly refused to feature. Nobody is even friends. Getting queerbaited by the Marvel Cinematic Universe is like losing at chess to a dog. Not even a smart dog like a German Shepherd. I'm talking yellow male Labrador levels of dumb. Weeb. Is, is this a submission or an accusation? Why can't it be both? Hey, come here. Listen to me. Don't sabotage your peace because chaos is familiar. Remember that. At the start of every month, everyone reblogs some insane poetry that's like, August has arrived and again I swallow my bones in the burning sun. And every time I'm like, damn, that makes no sense. But kind of true? Hello, August, you piece of shit. By the way, dating sucks is a concept. Meeting up with someone with the explicit goal of figuring out whether or not you want a relationship with them kind of spoils the dynamic. It sucks. It's terrible. Fall in love with your friends like normal people. As expected, this one is a hit with the autism website. I mean, I get it. It is kind of like, you know, animals just do it naturally. They kind of just like bird meets up another bird and performs a silly little dance and see if, you know, they're compatible. But we're humans. <laughs> We've kind of evolved past that, right? Cast iron? Yeah, that's a pretty common spell to learn. Cast iron becomes more powerful the more seasoned a wizard is. <laughs> you come into my post and be funnier than me? How dare you? This sucks so bad, I need to. Remember, suicide jokes only worsen my mental health. Put on the best talent show this town's ever seen. There we go. My son is normal. Sir, your daughter pretends to be a city on the internet. Holy crap, I can't believe the entire city of Buffalo, New York is trans, but honestly, I should have seen it coming. Hypothetical scenario for you all. The real King Arthur returns. You meet him, and you welcome him into your home. What is the first thing you do with him? Now keep in mind, this is a man from the 500s. He died in 542. And you are from the 21st century, 2024. One, explain what a TV is. Two, Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Uh, never beating the weird bitch allegations. Never beating the weird bitch allegations, Uwu. You sure are post Uwu fire. I will be more merciless than Satan himself when I strike you down. Firefox, 
I can't use Firefox because every time I download, the world explodes forever and I die painfully. Oh, Try one more time? Please? I mean, at this point, anything's better than Chrome, right? New experiment. Riddle the land of Tavat with cats. Experiment failed. There's no option to pet them. Oh my god, just delete the entire game. Pull it off the market. It, it can't be fixed. We can't save it, guys. I'm sorry. No, I don't care how hot you think Beto is. Just shut it shut it down. It's done. It's over. Close. You know, tattoos should actually make you more employable because it shows you can sit in place for hours while tiny needles are jammed into your skin. And that's what every corporate meeting I've ever been in has felt like. Why is Mr. Edible staying there? Is he dope it or something? Good lord, look at the motion blur on that cat. Mr. Edible has really been sitting there for a while. Yeah, you know, I hate to bring this up in the middle of a heist, but when I said I was a safe cracker, I met, like, a mature white guy. You know. Wow. If you look closely, you can see that the Olympics is actually set in the same cinematic universe as Ratatouille. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't breathe. <laughs> what is it about Ratatouille Cinematic Universe that took me out? You know, at this point, I don't even know if I'm breathing correctly. You're not polyamorous. You just need two people to love you at the same time like your parents did it. Ooh, funny, they could almost say the same thing about you. You are alive, you have a home, you have a bed, you have Food, you have clean water. Be grateful. Parents, when you tell them you have a mental illness. My cat just experienced the Aurora Borealis, one of the world's most radiant natural phenomena. She doesn't care. God, this is like when you show your friends your all time favorite show and they're looking at their phone the whole time. If you don't get hired for an unpaid internship, it literally makes no difference. Just show up and start working. What are they going to do? Pay you? Spotted at five guys. <laughs> oh my god. If they don't throw it out, that'd be a loss. Stop shaming people for reading kids' books. Adults' books are about sad people having affairs, while kids' books have a magic treehouse or a worm a driving an apple. You tell me who's winning. Yeah, but you can't be the weird guy in the corner of the bookstore reading the kids' books. Daniel. Okay, how about this? No more billionaires. None. After you reach $999 million, every red cent goes to schools and healthcare. You get a trophy that says, I won capitalism, and we name a dog park after you. How's that sound? Just don't give that deal to Musk. You would name the dog park X Park. Mmm, my favorite part of the Lunchables. The Italian Capri Sun. <laughs> Delightful. For weeks, my parents have been at war against a very resourceful rat, and I've been begging them to call pest control. But no, my dad would rather balance a banana on a two by four over a garbage can full of water like a fucking cartoon cat. You do realize though, if this works, your dad will be bragging about this for the rest of his life. Personally, I think his campaign's going great. JD Vance ridiculed for accidentally revealing explicit dolphin based search history. Oh, oh no. I thought I had it all together! If you're reading this, you're on Tumblr. Oh no. Psst, post this cat when they least expect it. No one will ever know. My name is Detective Sleeping, and I'm about to get started on my toughest case yet. The pillowcase. New experiment. Tell children please and thank you our swear words under certain contexts, and see if they become more polite. You know, that, that might actually work. 90% of doom scrollers always stop just one post before the clouds of uncertainty part and the shining bridge to the future manifests itself. The chariots, clad in shimmering gold, glide across the sky. Golden flecks of sunlight kiss the doom scrollers' pallid cheeks, returning them to a rosy hue of healthiness and mirth. Apollo stretches his hand out to them. The pain is gone. The winter has passed. Spring is carried on the backs of rabbits and the fur of honeybees. The nightmare is over. Now put the phone down. Looking through my notes app because sometimes I write creative ideas in there and... His voice was wrapped in a way he had only known spiders to be. 
What does this mean? That's... that's descriptive, all right. Perplexing, but descriptive. Hydrate! Be more specific. Pour water into your largest face hole. Be less specific? Yeah, it's gotta be really awkward if you're the one person surviving a massive cannonball wound. The guy next to us on this flight straight up brought a plain dodecahedron as his personal item? You guys want to hear what the most common reply to this was? A new hand touches the beacon. Admire folks who reblog posts which contradict each other. Exactly. Keep him guessing. Objectifying men in armor will literally never get old. Like, mm mm, work it, shiny boy. Hit him with that old razzadazzle, you fucking trash can hottie. Tucks five dollars into your chorus. Throw in some gold coins at the neck opening and hear it rattling all the way down. You know, I appreciate the content warnings and understand their importance, but I can't help but giggle a little bit when I click on a FNAF fic and half the chapters have child death warnings in their notes. Sir, this is the child death game. I think I know what I'm signing up for. Entering the child death and murder fandom. Why the fuck is this place so full of child murder? The fuck do you mean, OP? Isn't Five Nights at Freddy's about a silly little murder robot trying to kill you, an adult security guard? Am I missing something? Oh. Are you in the right headspace to receive information that can possibly hurt you right now? There are three groups of fictional men I find attractive. Absolutely pathetic baby girls. Villainous men who'd never love me back, who'd pretend to love me, but use that affection to walk all over me just like they do everyone else. And fancy men in suits. I am exactly 3,527 days late with this meme. <laughs> Saying ow, not because it hurts, but because it seems to be the correct thing to say at the moment is such a weird human trait. Right up there with oof. There are some internet friends where eventually you start calling them by their real name. And then there's times where it's like, nah, 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 son. Your name is Crispy forever. A relatable autism feel. Trademark. Which piece of my meal do I eat last? Which flavor will be the chosen one that will erase all others and prevail? Oh my god, I thought I was the only one. Boyfriend tells me I'm banned from fixing things around the house now. God forbid women do anything. We as a company are very dedicated to being diverse and hiring people from marginalized communities. Requirements. Master to degree. Ugh, this too shall pass, but like, holy fuck! Hey, 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 don't cry. I went to Manu Island and none of your friends were there. 